Okay, so I, t I titled this Two Players Blind Spyro. Even though only one of us is blind, and only one of us is playing it, but the person who's playing it is blind. But I'm also here at whatever, it's weird. <laughs> hey, we're doing Spyro. You titled it Two Person Blind Spyro. Well, I wanted people to, like, maybe they'd wander into the stream or see it on the front page and, like, you, hey. You did stream clickbait? Well, you should be ashamed of yourself. Not, okay, is it clickbait if it's accurate? If it's actually it's what the not is. accurate though. Well, it's you're not blind. <laughs> you're blind. Y I'm not. There are two people commenting. Uh, you are the mental gymnastics on you to try to make that work. Well, people like seeing people play it if they never played it before, and that—that's you. This is Jack's first Spyro. You will be punished. Go ahead and boot this up. Yep. Hello, Peter Chu. Analog off. I don't know why it defaults to analog off. It's a weird quirk with EPSX. Because PlayStation analog was introduced second. So. I know, but why would it not just automatically have it some, on? If some it's... games don't support analog. So don't turn it on for those games. And turn it on by default for all other games. They, but that, that would require a list that need to be updated. Would it? So as a result, just default it to all off, and if it, uh, and if no, just default it on, and then if it if the sticks don't work, they don't work. What is it with you and your incorrect opinions today? Is, is that, you're just, fuck you. You're as incorrect. <laughs> fuck, fuck, no, 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 fuck me, fuck you. <laughs> the adventure continues. Please, Spyro, don't. Oh, that's right. We we got we reached new new hub world. Listen to me, oh, we heard this already. This Spyro. Oh, she's if using she our name. It must be serious. You, and if she catches you, believe me, you don't want to know what she's going to do. Look, I promise to take good care of the rest of the eggs. I mean it. Just take Hunter and go back home before... Before... I can't say it. Just go. I can't wait to skateboard. I can't wait to, to skateboard some Dodongos. I can't wait to fling Norks. Legend of Zelda skateboarding. What if Spyro had a CDI game? I mean, it would probably be fitting the art style, I mean. Yeah? You think so? A rocket ship! Oh, okay. That's what we need to get to the final. So this is Hub World 3 the, the of moon? 4. Is that the last? Uh... Sure. To the moon. Okay, hold on. What happened? I, I see the slowdown, and I'm gonna guess that EPSXE didn't keep the priority again. Hi! Uh, hey, he's looking at me. Alright, try that. Seems better. Ah! Just gonna explore a little bit. Oh, there's a dragon egg up there? Looks like there might be. There's like a, a castle pillory thing. It looks like a lot of the things are gonna be underwater. You're racing the bee and honey speedway. You just got the egg. Good for you, Peter Chu. <coughs> right. So, I wonder what the animal is going to give me an underwater animal? A fish? We're gonna free a fish? A short while. Okay. Cool. Use it to get by these flame spitters. You'll find an egg when you get past them. Why? Oh, thank you. Why are there flame spitters just out here in the world? Put them here. Are these castle defenses? Oops. I will have to. I've been watching a uh, playthrough of Spiral One, and I actually just forgot for a second it would hover. I, I knew. I, I, I remember it. I'm like, oh, I hope I don't need to hover for this. Oh, I do. Okay. So, this is the sunken world, huh? Well, maybe this portion of it. I don't, I don't... Again, I don't remember this game as well as the others. I was able to get by that without hovering the other time. But why not just hover every time? <laughs> I I don't know, Silverog. Why don't I just hover every well, time? You know, some games don't support it, so you might not want to have it active by default. <laughs> you are really, you are 
are, you are, you have a stick up your ass today. Hello, Stuart. John Stewart. Oh, he's wearing a fellow kid's hat. I didn't watch the other streams. How many eggs do you have? 73rd. 73, that's how many. We have been, we've been keeping up with the eggs. So we've got all of the eggs that we're able to get at this point in the game. Not so the gems. We'll go back for those later. <coughs> yeah, I'm getting as many gems as I can find because I don't know when asshole will come and uh, like demand more. That's right. They sprinkled money bags most uh, thoroughly throughout this game. I think there might. I hope there isn't another egg in this path. All right, egg. Oh, hey. Egg. Yay. Ted. Ted. Ted McBain. No, he's got glasses. Theodore. Ted Dance. No. Theodore. Uh, Roosevelt. The Ro Roosevelt's pretty looking. He had glasses, right? Teddy. Teddy. Now, can I get over there from over here? I'm gonna say no. Okay, that's why I, I concur. Let us, uh, let's go enter some worlds. I was watching, uh, Renner Reyes from, uh, formerly of Achievement Hunter. Did playthroughs of Spyro and Crash. And, uh, I think he's at, every, the people in his chat were all throwing a fit about, about, uh, backseat playing. <laughs> he's got a rule on that. Oh, really? Yeah. Backseat. I guess he really doesn't like it when the chat starts telling him how to do things. <laughs> Unless he, like, asks, asks for it, right? I, didn't, I never saw him do it. Ask for it? Maybe he just never came to that point, though. He's one of those people who is just good at games. He picks up on things very quickly. Right. Something sense. alters. So, does that mean that you're gonna ease up on the backseat playing? I, I, I'm making a conscious attempt to. Okay. Welcome to Fancy Water Spider. Oh. On behalf of the Ice Fairies, <laughs> I want to grant you a special power for as long as you stay in our world. A special power? Is that so? <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, as long as we're in Ice World, we get ice breath. Oh, that's cool. That also seems to be a bit counterintuitive. Considering that there may be ice we need to melt. Was that worse oh. than the. Was that worse than the Minnesota? <laughs> That was bad. What was that? I mean, what was the accent supposed to be? It, really? was, it was British, but it was so whispery. It was like a really shitty Some attempt at Fluttershy. Use a defense system to protect us from Rhinox, but with these flippers, I can't even turn it on. And then you got this yeah, sleazy-sounding motherfucker with his flippers and switches. Yeah. yeah. He's doing the same fucking poses as Witch Girl. Look at that shit. Witch Girl? Yeah. Here. I'll show you. Maybe you could use the laser to melt that Look, ice block as well. Look, lean forward. Oh, witch girl? The 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 one that keeps flying to us on a rainbow. Oh, that. Yeah, her, she's a yeah. witch. Remember? Okay, yeah, yeah, I, I got Maybe it. Look, pose, pose, pose. Well. This fuck me voice he's got going on. Maybe you can use it. I'm a lounge lizard. I never sleep with the same woman twice. Okay, so I can move it with. All right. Wait, what's with this tropical fucking music for- Oh, you know, makes sense, right? Ice and snow. Steel drums. We're actually in Hawaii, but it's up on the mountains. This is the- that's the problem we need to solve. We're in Hawaii and it's frozen over. It's like Snowhead. Fortunately, we got a laser defense system. Oh, it did work eventually. I thought it just wasn't doing anything to him. Job done! Pretty early stream than usual. Yeah, Jack's got work tonight. I got work tonight. I got a rare nowadays late shit. Nope, can't light it. You got ice breath. Oh, okay. <laughs> Was I supposed to use the laser on it? I don't know. That works fine. Oh, okay. I see what they want me to do now. I missed that from my uh, angle. I don't even remember yeah. a lot of the levels in this game. Because, again, I owned the first two as a kid and played them a lot. This one I ended up getting later. We did get the chance to watch Johto and Super. Or Johto. Jojo. Just. Just. The Johto region. Just skate. The, the Josuke region Some, of uh, the Bizarre Adventure. He turned a guy into a rock. And it became a monument! 
It became a national landmark. What is... Is that a... a oh, it's a, like an elephant. Yeah. Okay, that's what I think of when I think of ice. Not mammoth, but... Wait! Ele elephant! What the fuck?! Elephant and Arabian motherfuckers. They... We were, Are we really in some, like, Aztec civilization that's been frozen over? The curse of the Aztecs. You will never see sunlight again. Aztec winter. What a weird concept for a level. <laughs> it's interesting. Actually, we're running out of ideas. It's like Mario Land weird. That's what I like about the Mario Land games on Game Boy. Eustace and I were having a Eustace. competition when the sorceress brought them to life with a spell. Since then, they've been stopped. That's just Tom Kenny being extra ball. sexy. <laughs> it it is Tom Kenny. Since I, they've been stomping around. I feel like yeah, I feel like that should be the, like a spy or something. It should be. That's the voice for that. But. Dow. Oh yeah, they are Essex because they're using the power of the sun. When I was younger, frozen altars creeped me out because of the giant snowmen. Giant snowmen, man. You watched uh, the movie uh, Jack Frost. Which one? The I know. I know. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. So famously, probably not. The, probably not the horror one as a kid. So famously, there are two versions of Jack Frost. There's the the family one starring. What was it? Uh, Rob Reiner? I don't know. No, it Rob was uh, no, not Rob Reiner. It was some other dude. And uh, I can't get up there. I don't know who it starred. Because he was a snowman for most of the movie. Yeah. He was a he was a guy who uh, who was like kind of a bad father, and then his son. It would be easy Hold on. to get up to that treasure if he had something to stand on. <laughs> hint, hint. Oh, How about you? Don't mind if I do. <laughs> You wanna stand on me? I'm primed and waiting for you. <laughs> then there was the other uh, Jack Frost, which was like. But a... there's a snowman! The other Jack Frost, in which uh, a, a serial killer, his DNA like, just fell into uh, some ice, so he became a snowman. I like how you said two versions of Jack Frost, implying from that they came both came from the same base script. Actually, it was it, the film was is actually a Rashomon style film. Half of it is is told from the perspective of the kid, this this uh, heartwarming family story, and the other half is told by the people that, that he was killed. We got an that AI was... situation. <laughs> I'd love to see somebody do a master cut of those two movies as if they were the same movie. Does Robotech it? Or, uh, even just a double feature. You see the Walmart bargain bin. Jack Frost and Jack Frost. Ja the Jack Frost duology! They that would be sequel. as bad as, uh, what was it? They paired as a double feature in Japanese theaters. Uh, it was, uh... Brave of the Fireflies uh, and My Neighbor Totoro. Which one came first? I, I want to say Grave came first. You want to... If you're going to do a movie like that... You want to fucking end... If you're going to do a movie you like Grave of the Fireflies, you want to end it on a high note. Something to bring him up afterwards, not the other way around. No, you don't... You don't want to... <laughs> kids are going to cry, and then you got to show them something magical. Then again, all the kids probably left the theater by the time Totoro came on. Yeah, that... Oh. Oh, we need a, we need a Yeti. Just go close up to one of those giant snowmen there, kind of creepy. Oh. We've just melted them all before going to see any. I. It's fine. Are they all gone, or will there be one more? Also, the music's so happy. Yeah. It's kind of Aztec, but. Oh. Oh, I'll talk to you first. Thanks for helping out, Spiral. Anytime, Eugene. You just let me know, little man. Why is Bowser on the wall, by the way? Just in time. Is is Bowser wearing a fez? <laughs> Bowser went here on vacation. Jana. He was the most important diplomat they've ever had here. Yeah. So they put him on a wall in his honor. Anyway, what about you? Portal? Spyro, you're a sports fan, aren't you? No. As you probably know, Frozen Altars is the birthplace of the great sport of cat hockey. Today's match <laughs> Fuck is you! It's terrible! Fuck you! I have a spare ticket that I'll sell you for, say, a teensy weensy markup. I... Couldn't it have stayed as just boxer hockey? It should be a thrilling match. In fact, 
<laughs> I've even placed a little wager on the Rhinoc team. Asshole. The local team doesn't have any last minute accidents. <laughs> you fucking antagonist, money bags. He is the antagonist. I placed a bet on the Empress's team. I'm gonna sabotage the home team. Challenged a Rhinoc to a traditional game of cat hockey. <laughs> I think I sprained my flipper during training. Oh darn! Would you mind taking my place, bro? Mind taking my place, bro? Great. Freeze the cats and push them into my goal to score. <laughs> this is. I can't not hear Tom Kenny. That's his normal speaking voice this too, is, just whispering. It's, it's SpongeBob as Squidward. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Oh, they're Cheshire. No, come back here! So we gotta freeze him and then knock him into the other goal? Knock him into our goal. I, I can't, oh my God, this is gonna, this is gonna be rough. Can I stop the other guy? I don't know. I other guy! I wonder how he's freezing them. I can! If he just has a, like a magic no, you touch. Don't. We're actually playing against Elsa. Elsa. Oh, Elsa Frontline SS? No, the the singer. Oh. Elsa. Oh. Wait, it's already in though! Yeah, it is. Oh, okay, yeah, you're right. Shit. I thought I thought it just wandered its way in here and it didn't count because I didn't freeze it. I don't know what to. What if I push you into my goal, huh? Do what I about that? Point? Do I just win automatically? No. Nope. No. Okay. Well, at least you're... make it harder for him to score for a while, though. Maybe. For fuck's sake, I. No. You have to understand how difficult this is. You control. Yeah. Uh, I do. Oh god. I have no idea what to do. I, uh, maneuverability is a slight issue. How the? You really need wide turns in general in this game, or the camera just doesn't cooperate. Oh my gosh! You can't. You really can't 180. By the way, when you say local team, you meant just the one dude. Yeah, team. This is a team game. Very clearly, just one on one. Ah, okay. Was it first to five? I hope not. It is. You should ask for a rematch. I think that guy sprayed catnip at his goal. <laughs> but there... is that an innuendo? If not, why are you making it sound like one? This might take me a couple of attempts. This isn't like when uh, those hockey players were attempting to, uh, like, attack that ballerina. Yeah. This is a bit more difficult than that. At least you know the Rhinoc doesn't sound like this. Cats! Meow. Can the cats just all be Gary? Yeah. All the dudes are SpongeBob. Okay. The, no, because because Gary's a snail. Yeah. That He's not a cat! That didn't stop Spongebob Still. from being a duck. Was he a duck? Right here! Oh, yeah, you're right. Shit. I, I thought he was a penguin. I thought that, that was a penguin, not a duck. Oh, I have no idea. Oh, it makes sense that, uh, okay, then it makes sense that, uh, or that, that of, he's voiced like that. Some kind of Aztec bird. Oh, get it? Because he's cool? You know, you know why, uh, you know why, why, uh, the duck sounds like that? Why? Because uh, apparently in biology, ducks are like their their uh, mating rituals are kind of rapey. Oh, so that's why he's using that voice. Yeah, I I, I suppose. Like no, I'm not even joking. They I are. No, I know. That, I mean, that's a lot of animals. Well, it's to a point where the feet. The anyway, I'm not gonna talk about this anymore. Okay. Sorry to anyone who's looking forward to the duck rape conversation. Come on. I have just one more! For fuck's sake! Yeah, I did it! Well done. I think you deserve to keep the Champions Cup. Thanks. That's an egg. Ba-ah. Ba Fuck! 
fucking what? That's not a dragon, that's a sheep. Oh. Oh. <laughs> How did that get in the egg? That's a birth deformity. Rhinox such a drubbing. He's retired from the sport for good. That's kind of sad, actually. <laughs> Well, it's fine. He cheated because of catnip. All right, I'm gonna go now. Is there anything else I, I can do here? I doubt it. I can't wait for the skill point that requires us to uh, get it without him landing a single goal. I don't think that exists. I sure hope it doesn't. You're retired, and yet you're still playing here. Well, he can he still do it as a hobby. Are you just giving him a goal? There. You did it. You did it. You can feel better about your. Uh, I just made a tactical error. I don't know. I don't think I can get out. Just jump. Oh, yeah. Okay. All right. So that's uh, one egg. No, that's two eggs. Out of. Well, there's still there's one area we can't get to because Yeti. We didn't go over here. Or is this the start of this is the start of the level? I think. Yep. Well, let us find out. Two of six. Across the rooftops. Okay. Okay, gotta do some parkour. Sure. <laughs> I'm doing it now, fuck. Doing what? Sure. Oh. Get up to the rooftops. Okay. Am I on the rooftop? Yeah, okay. Uh, I don't think we can make it from here. We could try. Yeah. No harm in trying. Uh, well, unless... Hold on. Can I jump up here? Nope. Just out of reach. Well, it's also very sloped. Spire's and a, a game like this, it could have gone either way. Spire's a quadruped. He doesn't like slopes. Okay, I better get back up there. You think his claws are cold? Cold? I don't imagine this would be comfortable, running through the snow. I, dragon scales are... Aren't dragons, like... Really... They're heat-resistant. I guess but they're cold-resistant, too. Yeah, I think it could go both ways. Oh, it's a dodo! Uh, Oh, I'll leave you alone. I don't want to make. I don't want to extinct you. You don't deserve to go extinct. Ah, uh, fuck. So we need to get up there yeah. from somewhere. From there, no. Uh, oh, wait, hold on. I see that. Hold on. But I need to get up somewhere. Fuck. Okay. I think you got a route. Like, I think you got a route in my head. Hey, remember me? Ow! Man, if only I could stop. Ice doesn't like that, though. Ice doesn't want to stop. Okay. Damn it. <laughs> Fucking money bags just stealing all my shit. I, I like out the fact that he wasn't even all that villainous in the last game. And then... He was just a businessman in Spyro 2. Now he's everywhere and, like, audacious about what sinister shit he's gonna do with this swindled money. Oh! Oh, wait. Wait we'll a minute. Is that an egg down there? A barrel, maybe? Well, I hope it wasn't an egg. Come on. You'd think the snow would melt. Oh, that's the curse of this place. Yeah. This place is is uh doomed to be forever cold. Uh Well uh we'll be back to this and other levels to check out the gems. So we'll uh we'll take a look at the snowmen then. Okay. Oh, and we're also going to have to come back for the yeti thing. So Yeah, so either way. Fuck. All right. Uh Oh, here we go. Here we go! Uh, uh, that's back, where we were. Fuck. So, this way then. Oh, we're down to one hit. I know. Should grab the dodo. I hope we didn't need to stand on an enemy. Maybe one of them? Fuck, you're right. I just thought. Oh, wait, there was, a, was there a path on the right? Yeah. There's... Oh, we can just walk up. Never mind.
Oh, there's Dodo. There are Dodos down there. This sounds like it's music from a very different series. This sounds like it's music. It sounds like I'm. I'm in, it's supposed to be a jungle right now. Yeah. This isn't fucking snow music. I get to hear this in like, uh, like Bonk's Adventure or something. What the fuck is? Or what? What? What's that? What is a caveman game that? Uh, Toe Jam and Earl? No. Uh, the one that. Uh, was it Granddad ripped it off? A uh, Flintstones? No. Granddad Flintstones. No. Well, okay. Well, that was that. There was a there was an, a different caveman game, and I just can't remember the name of it. <laughs> the one that Granddad ripped off. No, a different one. It was two characters, X and Y, and I don't remember. Toe Jam what it and was. Earl. No, it wasn't that. That they're not cavemen. Mac and oh, uh, Mac and Joe and Mac. Joe and Mac. That's, that's the one. Hey Jasper. Jasper. Working hard at Ron. Jasper the friendly Ron toast. Ron. Toast? Toast. <laughs> Jasper the friendly toast. Oh no! Yeah, it's like uh he's the he's related to powdered toast man. Have we been in here before? Yeah, this was the end of the level. Oh. Oh yeah, you're right. So was that the rooftops one or that a different was, one? I believe that was the roof, rooftop does, one. Uh, does Select go straight to the Atlas? I, yeah, you're right. Uh, but first... Glide from the temple roof. Okay. So there's one more roof one at least. Yep, I'm going for that one. Probably two in the Yeti area. I know which one I'm going for. The... Still have your hopes up for those slopes. Uh, I mean, there are some slopes that aren't like that in some games, like... I'm just saying, Spyro's not one of them. By the way, Mario Maker Slopes DLC when? Man. Mario Maker... They had the gall to include slopes in the Mario Maker Smash level, too. <laughs> what cocksuckers? Fuck. <laughs> All right. Uh, so I can't just walk over there. It doesn't look walk acrossable. Yeah, because it probably was, and then they realized, wait, we don't want people doing this. So they just kind of like eat the polygon, so it was not. It was sloped. Is what it looks like. They did. Yeah. I need to get over there. Can I? I don't know if I can make it over across that way. I bet you made that, that lower roof on yeah, the Yeah, I see that. I'm gonna go for it. Boop. I didn't even need to glide. It's just some... It's just some fucking... Uh, it is. What? So... So there's nowhere to go from here. Darn. Hmm. Could be doable. You could try it. There's stuff up there, so we have to be able to get up there. Oh! oh I maybe don't... Maybe at a better angle. Okay. So I was gonna say, yeah, probably not. Alright. Let's go That looks doable to me. This is the most this is the most rooftop jumping we've had to do in this game thus far. Yeah, I think. <laughs> Unless we get to a city level. Yeah. Why is this underwater? Spyro Odyssey. I I could you could do it you long could try, ways. Or you could try walking it. That really doesn't look walk acrossable, but No. Yeah, I don't think I'll- I, I looked at how the angle was going, and yeah, I don't think I can make it if I try just a straight up, uh... Yeah, I, I think you could have done it from that other roof. Yeah. I tried again from that other roof. Uh, if so, that's a very tight glide, uh, very tight glide, though. Yeah. I'm surprised you would have done that. Save the... 
Yeah, the intended glides tend to be very, very generous. Yeah. But then again, that that glide looked like it could be. It's level, but it's closer. Okay. You have to from the top level, remember? Oh yeah, you're right. Shit. I you was... got it there before. Yeah, it was. It what? just wait a minute. Specific. There we go. Okay, that was weird. I had to glide up, like up. Okay, so you get it. At the closest corner, as close as possible. Trying to rotate the camera. Well, that's a cinematic shot. Okay. So I want to aim for that corner. Yes. Okay, sounds good to me! Uh, I did it! <laughs> hey! I can't believe that would be how you're supposed to do it, but I didn't see any other way up here. Well, we're here now. Uh... I'm gonna guess don't fall in the center. Probably not. Oh. Hey. Slopes! Hey, look at slope! Yeah. That I can stand on! A light slope, not a 45 degree slope. Who is it? C Cecil! C Cecil. Hey, Onbar. <laughs> she just got back from Final Fantasy and she's traumatized. So the only place we haven't been are those steps there, right? Uh, oh yeah, the. Oh, do we have? Do we have to do it again? <laughs> we have to do it again. I we have to do it twice. Box of Yeti. So oh, those are probably both Yeti ones. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say there's probably nothing but gems on those steps. All right. Unless there isn't, but then. And... We'll pro we'll probably get the Yeti this stream and come back. Actually, we are gonna get the Yeti. We should have done that first. Yeah, we're to. Uh, He's in, remember, oh, yeah. they're all in the hub world somewhere. Shit. So we can exit here for now. Okay. <laughs> Spyro is allergic to slopes. It's those dragon claws. They just don't have grips because he gets his cut. <laughs> he, he doesn't want to hurt anyone. That's why he doesn't have a scratch attack. Wait, that was the underwater. Yeah, that was! I was mentioning this over and over. I didn't, no, I, I know this is the underwater world, but... Tech Snowland was the underwater level. So it's always frozen. Uh. All right, we need to find. We need to find the captured Yeti and save him from the evil tyrant, tyrant money bags. You're gonna have to go underwater, Jack. There's no way around it. What's up here? What? There we go. Oh, it's the Sparks place that we can't do yet. Oh, because you gotta beat the world before you unlock the Sparks level. Okay. We do Cannonball! have the ball. Graceful, ten out of ten. Oh God, is money actually gonna be down here? Well, I'm sure the underwater like links to another part that's above water. Firework something. Those fireworks work underwater. Wow, those are good fireworks. Yeah, that's is pretty good. All right. Hello, Mr. Whale. Uh oh. Oh, he ate me! He can do. Oh. Oh, okay. Cool. Jonah. Of course, his name's Jonah. <laughs> hey, hey! I'm swimming. He was walking on his hands. Now let me out, Jabu Jabu. That was disgusting. I bet dragon meat's very tough. I bet, yeah. I mean, it's not to mention the hide. They'd be very hard to digest. Okay, uh, I'm trying to get my bearing again. So that's uh. So many. Oh, here we go. Oh, speed underwater speedway. Well, we know money bags is gonna be on the surface somewhere, a surface. Yeah, a surface, but over here. Okay. I think I can suss out where he is. The 
wouldn't have they wouldn't have hit him in a level, would they? No. No, he's always in the hub world. Yeah. I think. There was a shooting at a video game tournament. Oh no! In Florida. Oh, that's no good. I, I saw Mario and I was confu and I was like confused why he was on the trending. Why? You Damn it! Well, that brought this stream down. That that sucks. A shooting at a video game tournament? Yep. Damn it! What? Maybe it was a, uh, maybe it was a diehard Jack Thompson loyalist. Shut up. Don't joke about that. It's too soon. Okay. Okay, I think he's over there. You see him? It has to be over oh, there. Oh, in that little, uh, yeah. castle spot. Now, how do we get up there? Oh. From the spark place. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. I mean, since you mentioned it, you might as well, like, find out, like... No, like, I'm looking up the... I was looking up the Yeti. There is a glitch in this hub world where if you go to Fireworks Factory and go in the lava, you lose all your health, but right before you die, pause and leave the level, then you can swim on air in the overworld. <laughs> oh, it's just another egg. So You're not the uh, one I was looking for. That's four eggs. I mean, okay. Uh, I guess what I guess we can do that. In Evening Lake. That's the hub world. Where is money bags? I don't know. It doesn't. It just says it's, it's in Evening Lake. Where in Evening Lake? Just uh, money bags and fucking scuba gear. Over here. Is it? Well, it's a Yeti, not a fucking mermaid, so he can't be underwater either. Unless he's in like an oxygen bubble. The portal to his home is the only portal that is not underwater, although it is still under the surface. Uh, uh. is there an underwater cave or something? Uh. So it's not underwater, but it is under the surface of the water. So it's an underwater cave. I guess so. That's the only way I can interpret that. All right. We have to look for some odd place to surface in these tunnels. We're looking. I'm going to guess it was uh wait. X yeah. X marks the spot. What, wait, whoa, 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 what, what is this? Yeah! Oh, hey, another egg. Fuck. World. Stooby. Evening Lake, Evening Lake, Homeworld, Native Species, wow. Dragons. That's not true. Dragons haven't existed here for a thousand years. Yeah, we just went away. Become the dragon. Okay, so... That's where we were. That's where we got the dragon from. Oh. The dragon from. Uh, this, uh... You're trying to follow a wall? Yeah. This is the outside wall.
Good thing Dragon uh, Spyro can hold his breath forever. Yeah, this would be on. way harder if we had to deal oh. with oxygen. Like Echo the Dolphin style. Oh, that's right. Echo was a, Echo was a mammal. Did yeah. he have to like surface every now and then? Yeah, he had an oxygen, a limited oxygen supply. He had a limited one? Yeah. I've never substantially played an Echo game. Uh, neither have I, but uh, the fans of Echo, they really fucking like uh, Echo. I imagine it plays like 2D Knights. Oh, oh, hey! Well, you really tried to hide this one, you greedy asshole. Man! <laughs> the sorceress has a real prize on her hands here. <laughs> it took two dozen Rhinox to capture this dim-witted furball. Oh, yeah. Fuck you! He's not Yetis go for high, bar high prices at the slave trade. 1,000 gems. Oh, we're how gonna sell them at, uh... Fucking the archipelago. One piece. Money, it. Spyro. <laughs> it's not just lying around on the ground, is it? Uh, is it? <laughs> so he's also oh, blind. Right it's mine now. All right, how's the Yeti gonna kick his ass? Sure, I'm sure there's some cool text there. <laughs> uh, ah, the first rejuvenating breath of freedom. With the humility of a wounded sparrow, I genuflect to my noble Genuflect, <laughs> yes! Uh, it was no big deal, dude. Yes. <clears throat> After all, it was I who let you out. Why, you brazenly avaricious, duplicitous, larcenous ursine! Now oh, hold on! <clears throat> oh, why can't you see- One more, perhaps? At least. <laughs> Even Spyro doesn't care, or care about him anymore. Do me the sublime honor of enjoying your visitation in the nearest future. Yeah, sure. That looks great. Smaller than than money bags, the bear though. It's a small yeti. <laughs> it's fine. It's compressed. That means he's he's tough for his size. He's got uh, extra muscle in there. If he were to let out all his power, he'd be as tall as a skyscraper. Oh yeah. Larcenisser sign! <laughs> Avariously. <laughs> so, it, oh, you call him dumb? Look, his vocabulary is pretty good! Maybe the Yeti never I deigned to speak to him. I will help you on your quest, Spyro. But first I must attend to my young sibling. I'm afraid he may have gotten himself into trouble during my absence. Oh dear, you don't say. Well, you must uh, attest to that immediately, my dear friend. <laughs> Oh, he's got a club spin? That's his- Fuck whacking with it, right? Got a fucking kung fu martial art- Oh, there it is. So that's what Square does. So Square's whack and circle is spin? Hey, bro, it'd be really cool Fuck if you fully. smash that boulder. A swift smack. British as fuck. Yeah. The British yetis. Hey! Wait, I thought the penguin was supposed to be British. No? Oh, the-, the Yeah, English, that's right. Yeah. I was thinking of the ducks still. That poor rabbit. How dare you bring fire into my beautiful world. Oh, well that did fuck all. <laughs> I'm gonna guess that's more of a projectile deflection thing. Sly, Sly and Spyro crossover, Bentley beats Brentley. Sly! We gotta get out of here, Sly! Get out of here! He'll massacre us! <laughs> I say, don't judge by appearances, old maid. Oh, there's a lot of things up on the totems. If you use your spin move to deflect the snowball into the gong, I bet we can make the roof cave in. Okay! Alternatively, I could just chuck a rock, because I'm a fucking yeti. <laughs> no? No rocks around here? Oh, hold on. I think you have to aim it. Oh, there it goes. Oh, this is, this is so janky. At least you can rotate in place. I like how even the background music is British. It goes, OI! 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 What's you it? can just hold it in place and rotate to it, it, it dies, right. it dies after oh, a while. Oh, it's limited time? Yeah. 
<laughs> he sounds like fucking Zach Gibson. Who, the little one? Uh, the big one. Yeah, the little one. Oh, Actually. that worked. So you have that same accent. Zach Gibson, Liverpool's number one. Is that a wrestler? Yeah. Brian! But Brian! Oh, you ate butter. He eats you butterfly. ate butterfly, Brian. Oh shit! Oh, hey. that's a big snowball. He uses a piece of ice as a. Are you aiming somewhere? Uh, yeah, somewhere. I think. Okay, fine. I think you're the enemy. Oh! <laughs> no, Brion. Why? That's a Pokemon. So, in the world of the Yetis, in the culture of the Yetis, treasure is traditionally kept in chests atop giant totems. That's yes. where it's safest. That's, uh, that's where the gods can, like, admire it. Unfortunately, it's, we need every single penny. It's like putting your, uh, it's like putting your fish up in a tree so bears can't get it. Ah! We got a treasure raider! Oh, it's the key. We got it back. Oh. They're Rhinox, right? Yes. Big Rhinox. Not, not Forks. Nope. Not. Second game didn't have its own thing. Ripto didn't have his own uh, regular lackeys. He just had the two. He had Flotsam and Jetsam. Oh, no. And his presence was enough, I guess, to rile up the wildlife. That's a, that was his true power at the end of the day. Yeah. He had the uh, he had the ability to use the local wildlife to attack. Oh, he's a wise of Thornberry. <laughs> no, sorry. Actually, we were watching Teen Titans and uh, not go the original Teen Titans. The original Titans. one. And I was saying, so Aquaman and Aqualad can talk to fish, right? Yes. But they also have like, do, do they just automatically do they brainwash fish or they just have charisma? They, I think it's the fact that they're royalty. Like, what if the fish just said, okay, you can talk to us. That doesn't mean we're going to do what you want us to. <laughs> and they just didn't listen. I'm a gong. What an even more useless power it would be then. If he not only had, if he could not only just control fish, he had to convince the fish to do what he wanted. Fish, come. What's in it for us? Uh, I'm came to the fucking sea. I say. Eliza Thornberry had to deal with that. Yeah. Also, he can't communicate with land animals. Land animals just don't like him. Yeah. has blocked the way with this box. Eliza, no. Now, here's a question. Do, do crabs count? Can he, like, talk to crabs? That's a good question. We need the details of Aquaman's fish telepathy. Hold on. I'm gonna give you You're a just gonna sit on your brother? Give me a boost. Okay. Oh, Yeti, he's strong. Hey, I did it. Hey, you're in the way! Move! <laughs> you're in the way! Move! <laughs> well, that was unexpected. Charlie! What the fuck? Hey, he does the slide. Hey, brain out. You're supposed to be smart. Why don't you try pushing those blocks around to bridge that gap? Wow, what happened to you? You're suddenly such an asshole. I thought we were being just having a nice, like, you're bro my, moment. You're my brother. Like, I stand in the way briefly and suddenly you're in asshole mode. Maybe he's just pissed because he, because you're super strong and he's not. And he's just, like, feeling jealous about that. And his big brother's stronger than him and smarter than him and... Scrappy dude just wants to prove himself. You just shaking your torch at me at infinite rage, buddy? He doesn't want us in that cave. Well, some cave. I don't want you in my cave either. I wonder what kind of British that is. It's not it's not London, but it's not quite it's a little cockney. It's not quite the, like up to eleven cockney though. It's not orc voice. Uh, it's. I think it's like Liverpool. Yeah. I want to say, but I, I don't know. 
British accents enough. It's like if somebody listens to a Florida accent and says, Oh, that's Texan! Yeah? It'd be offensive to us, uh, Americans. Oh, yeah, clearly. We get offended I guess. by everything. I mean... I just call Southern Southern. I don't differentiate. Apparently there is the there were these Christian uh, filmmakers who thought that uh, Cantonese and Mandarin sounded exactly the same, and that pissed off Chinese people. Well, no, they 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 knew enough to fix it by the next movie. Oh yeah. Oh, so they just like mixed the two languages for a Chinese speaking character. Yeah, or yeah, and his father. Oh. Who were, did not actually speak Chinese? The actors, I would assume. I. Maybe they did, I don't know. And they just rolled with it? Like, <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't know what he's writing. Sure. <laughs> I mean, I didn't know either until, like, it was pointed out to me, but... How did Ripto survive Lava and make it to enter the Dragonfly? How did he survive Lava and make it to the Spyro 2 epilogue? <laughs> I guess Ripto is Dragon Tough. Ripto, did somebody use the Dragon Balls to rest? To Ripto, or whatever race he is, it's his tough. No, not even Spyro can uh, can survive lava. He gets burned. That's because he's a baby dragon. Well, so is Spike. Spike can swim in lava. Oh, can he? Yeah. He did it in a. Uh, well, he's an equestrian Pony. dragon. Oh, that's yeah, different. Those, those are aren't bipedal. Those are quad bipedal. Those aren't quadrupeds. Yeah. Is that the difference? Yeah. A different biology. I guess Spyro is more of like an ice dragon. Well, then, like no, a because... plains dragon. Okay, so now we have the Yeti. Let's go. Let's go. We can go back to that world we were just in, or we can go back to the previous world and get there's one level oh, we needed him for. Oh, is there? We, we can do the hub world like at one when we do the gym collections. Okay. Or I mean, uh, well, unless... we wanted to try to get. We wanted to try to get all the eggs as we're going. I mean, we're here now. Let's let's go hit this one, and then we'll go back to the other one. All right, go up. Uh, go up and look at one of the snowmen before you melt them. Sure. Let's do it. Hey, play Spyro on PS2. I I've played Spyro on PS2. I'm sorry to say, it wasn't good. We'll get to it. We'll do a. Uh, We'll do is like it, a, a one-off stream. Who voices Spyro in the in those ones? I don't know. We'll do a one-off stream of Spyro the Your Enter the Dragonfly. That's the PS2 one. The first one. Hey, you know what? Maybe I'll like it, and we'll do more of it. And then regret it when we like I did with Sonic Shuffle. I think I can say with confidence that you won't like it. Just from the way it controls, you'll know immediately. Maybe, maybe I'll like it. Maybe I'll like the way PS2 Spyro controls better. Have you thought of that? I have. You won't. Uh, I've played the first PS2 one, Enter the Dragonfly. The second one they did was uh, Hero's Tale, that I have not played. Reportedly, it was at least a little bit better. At, wor at worst, like, generic. So that sounds like the Wrath of Cortex of the Spyro series. After that was when they started doing the, uh, the, like, dark timeline, the dark trilogy. The dark oh, the is gone. No, I didn't get to them yet. Oh, there's one. There's one. Alright, how creepy do these snowmen look? Yeah, kind of creepy. I guess if you walked up to him. Oh, he comes lunging at you. And then the silly sound effect. That would be more. That would be scarier without the silly sound effect. Jesus and I were having a snowman building. Yeah, I know, creepy Tom Kenny. I've never played any Spyro games besides the first three. You're not missing out. The first one. Wait, I, I have an idea. Yeah, you see if you can kill him now. Oh no, he just grows back. Oh. Oh wait, hold on! I have another, another idea. Oh. Oh. Okay. Yeah! The first one on PS2, the one I'm talking about, is one of those games where you have to, like, rotate in the direction you're about to move before you move forward. Oh. It doesn't have- it is terrible controls. Well, so it's tank control. Tank that, controls? That's not what tank controls are, but okay. similar, yes. Okay. 
Wait. I think I can get to that other egg from here. Oh, that's how we were supposed to get to that ledge. Right yeah. Here. Maybe. We Sorry. already got that egg, though. Did we? Yeah, we're going to the Yeti. Oh. Place, wherever so, that is. So, so the way we got the egg was totally not intended. Yes. <laughs> and I figured it was, because that, that was too hard a glide for them to have intended, but... Hey, oh, we managed it. it. The Legend of Spyro trilogy was the one that they tried to get all, all like, serious with. Dark and edgy. And in that one, he's voiced by Elijah Wood. Elijah Wood?! He's voiced Spyro in the, in the dark, in the edgy That's trilogy. That's so fucking weird! It's pretty weird. Like, no, no offense to Elijah Wood! Wasn't that he also in that other Thumble- one of the Thumbelinas we found? Was Elijah Wood? Oh, yeah. It, oh. Was, it was a different Tom Thumb meets Thumbelina. <laughs> oh, no, 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 I don't wanna... Alright, here we go. Alright. Yete. What? Oh, he's boxing? I received word from my little brother. He appears to be having some trouble with the Yeti. A beer yeti. Oh, Ripto grew a mustache between games. Fat Dom Yeti took In the my eye. ball. I oh. told him to give it back or you kick his lousy butt, but he wouldn't listen. Oh, man. Oh, there's another Yeti on Yeti oh, violence. Yeti, don't but Yeti's don't gotta stick together. To mess with us. Remember well, if I said no. When he tries to block. So I can do a quick jab, a body blow, a big hookaroo, and I can block high. Okay. I can play block low automatically. Oh, this is... Oh, that Yeti! What's he doing here? Sure, Yeti boxing, why not? Hey! Okay, so Spyro was still Tom Kenny in PS2. In the first one, at least. Oh, he's got corner. Hold on. I can't move! Back off. I think Hunter and Moneybags change voices. I can't- Moneybags is back! Uh, Billy West and D, and D. Bradley Baker are in it. As some, D some people. Fuck! D. Bradley Baker's the guy who does, like, all the- All the wacky animal cartoon voices. Like, oh! Oh! Cross counter! Appa and Momo were D, D. Bradley Baker. You lot! How am I supposed to get my ball back? This guy's tough, dude. That voice sounds familiar, so familiar for the little baby Yeti. I wonder whose voice I'm thinking of. Somebody. Oh god. In the new be in the new beginning game, Sparks has a voice and is annoying. Is that the Legend of Spyro trilogy? Is that the edgy ones? Hold on. Oh gosh! Oh! Punch out's tough, yo! This guy, okay, I gotta, okay, I think, I think I know this, how the system works now. Yeah? I think I got it. Maybe. Oh, he backs off whenever he... I think he's reading my inputs. I'm curious to see the Reignited Trilogy. And I'm God sure- God damn it! I'm sure people will have complaints about it. I'm just curious what they're gonna be. Because the main complaint I've seen for Crash... ...is that they changed the shape of his hitbox. I don't know how this is... How am I supposed to beat this guy? I don't know. They changed the shape of his hitbox in the first two games from... Originally it was a block, and now it's pill-shaped. And I guess that fucks with some of the hit like hitboxes and platforming. Okay, why did that not work? Too far away. Oh. 
Maybe I can... Oh my gosh. Did you combo, like, uh, high punch? I'm, I'm trying, I was trying, but... And hook? But he backs off. You see the way he, like, moves backward? Yeah. Also, he's got priority on all those moves. I don't think he has priority. I think he's just hitting. Yeah, I, I don't know. Try to focus on counterattack, maybe? Yeah. There's no counterattack, it's just block. I know, like fi fire back immediately after you block one of his punches. Also, this is a he automatically blocks low. Yeah. He doesn't, though. That's a lie. Does he not just... Is it just unable to block low? I, he says, oh, he automatically blocks low, and then it's just like, nope. That's not true. That's not even remotely true. He hasn't blocked low once. Can I try? Yeah, go ahead. Dude, I don't... It is... The fighting is... So fucking stiff. What does this kid... What does this Yeti want with his ball anyway? Uh, he wants him to not... The other guy to not have it. What is it? Triangle is block high. Yeah. Yeah, I make the block slow. I guess if you do... If you just hit no buttons, that's what... That's, that's what he blocks low. X is hit is body blow. Yeah, you see it... it it's hit... He's far back. Wow. Oh, oh, you got him. So you barely made it, though. Barely. Now, what's the second egg? <laughs> you really showed him. Hi. This isn't my ball. Ailey. Allie. You should go back and kick his butt again. Make him give me my ball back. Yeah. This a three round match. And when you win, don't let him send you off with a stupid egg. You don't remember this? I, do, I don't. I don't. Again, I don't remember much of this game. He's responsive. He'll start getting more aggressive if I if I keep pressing in and get aggressive with him. So. so. The controls are weird. I gotta remember where the uh, block is. I keep trying to press triangle for a high attack because that seems like it would make too much yeah. sense. <laughs> Down one. Only two more rounds to go. You're doing great. You have to confirm your pre-order to get the Spyro Remaster. I'm waiting for the Switch or Steam announcement. Preferably, preferably on Steam. I already recover all that health. Oh, that sucks. This, I think this is my least favorite segment. Yeah. This is, this is, uh... Go down! This is a really bad fighting game. Yeah. 
I mean, it's no clay fighter. <laughs> Is clay fighter bad? I don't know. Play clay fighter. To compare. I know it had a Yeti in it. Did, didn't like one of them have one of them have like earthworm gym? Did him? Yeah. I don't know. Were there multiple clay fighters? Yeah. There were multiple clay fighters. That's it. Yep. Yeah. You got a punch in the gut. You did a back bump. What the fuck? This needs a competitive hey, scene. Oh, some brother you are. I'm never gonna see my boy. Hey! Again, don't I? talk like that. How about you go in there and fight him? Yeah? No? That's what I thought. This time it'll be a. Bit no shit. <sighs> See, I mean, you see how difficult this is. Uh, yeah, I didn't say it wasn't. Jab. Imagine not having the platformer, not having a, a fighter engine. What you mean? <laughs> but we need to include mini games, or the kids will get bored. They have no attention spans. Let's. See. Let's see if we if we fight uh, in oh I don't know a game of tennis. Doing better this time. Yeah. Ow. Bentley the Yeti for Smash Five. You can closer. Come on! All right, you won that round. Only two more rounds to go. You're doing great. Thanks. Sure, if you say so, little brother. Mm. Punch. Did I found the cheese? Come closer. Hey, come here. Come here. Stop hitting yourself. Get it out. What's the matter? <laughs> I damn it. You having trouble? Oh, that's too bad. If only this game had stale moves, right? Just... I mean, he seems to be adapting. Your, your reach is somehow not as... Well, for the, the big hook goes farther, but he doesn't use that very often. Yeah. And it also has a wind-up, so if he uses it while he's close, it doesn't matter. Yeah, the... Yeah, you seem to have figured it out. Come on! Come on! I'm gonna fuck you up, I will! And then he just uh, does the, he just does this over again. Oh, come on! I had him! This is the last round! Finish Hopefully this part will be better in the Reignited trilogy. Yeah, I hear they just, uh, they imported the Smash Brothers engine? Yeah. <laughs> You're just gonna have to, like, knock him off the side of the level. To, uh... Yeah, this is a uh, very, very, uh, very, very stiff. If there's not something I, I don't want to fight or eat, it's very stiff. Yeah, that's a problem that uh, that a lot of anime fighters had was that they were very, very stiff. There we go. So. Yeah, like the Super NES ones or. Like the like, name some examples. Ronmo one half had that problem. The Super bag. NES one? What? The Super NES one? Yeah, it had. It, it wasn't like Street That Fire. one didn't play well. Rocco! Rico! No, shut up, it's Rocco. Rico! Suave. Rico. Suave. Alright, so that's that level. Okay, select mm -hmm. does go to the Atlas for that level. Back to Jack. Rico. Do the, uh, you wanna do the sparks level? Oh no, that, that's alright. I thought we were in the... I thought we'd gone back well, to the we're other. we're an hour level. in, we finally managed to polish off a level. Alright, let's go Lost to the... Lost Fleet! Lost Fleet! They're gonna be pirate Rhinox? <laughs> Please let there be pirate music. You know what this game doesn't have? It what? doesn't have the little, uh... The little intro and outro cutscenes that Spyro 2 had. Yeah. I like kind of missed that. Be careful around these parts. Crazy <laughs> aired! This 
here shipyard than I can shake me pick it. God damn it. Darn shame, too. Because I was mighty close to finding me trash. Redneck mine pirate ghost shipyard. Okay. Okay, sure. <laughs> I thought I already did the hillbillies and that fuck and haunted shit in the previous world. We did, like, uh... No, we did Louisiana Haiku Asian. Remember? This is different, different <laughs> thing. This world is the best. This game is the best. This game has some very zany, outlandish worlds. Well, I'm gonna guess that green shit kills you. You might wanna get a thing. Doesn't matter. Before we start the game, we start with full health. So, yeah, game over is doing nothing in this one. Oh, it's a ghost! It's a spooky ghost! With ectoplasm. Oh, it goes. This is the- this is just the fucking Scooby-Doo level. We've arrived! We found it! Yeah! Direct it! Fuck having real pirates, right? So they're not ghosts, they are Scooby. Fuck, they're just Rhinox in sheets. Nope. Oh. I guess it wasn't worth hiring corn to solve this mystery after all. Do you like corn? Oh, darn it. Corn's groovy pirate ghost mystery. Oh, don't, don't, we'll, we'll keep that the surprise for Jack. Don't tell him yet, chat. What the? There's something in this level. I know. Some mystery machine. Series, except they're dubbed over by just Tom Kenny. Like Tom Kenny voicing all five of the Scooby Doo characters. <laughs> I can see that as a YouTube series. Janky Scoop. That's something you give to Tom Kenny if he's like ran out of uh, ideas. Yeah. You'd have to have a voice actor who was famous, bored, and uh, I guess he wouldn't have to be doing a lot of paid work if he was able to maintain a YouTube show. Yeah. Oh, you could, you could, you could oh is that a cannon? You could subscribe to his Patreon. Yeah. Don't hit crazy, Ed. So, uh, we, we, uh, speak, uh, speaking of which, we've hit, uh, 300 subscribers recently. Oh, we did, yes. Yes, uh, thank you for everybody who subscribed. We appreciate uh, it. I was, in fact, thinking about setting up a Patreon. Uh, I think we, we just, get anyone on it. No, it's fine. We can start, and if people want to, like, subscribe, they can. Yeah. Did I? No? And I want, and now I, I know what you're asking, but Jack, what would the money go to? And my answer to you is, what do you think it's gonna go to? Better equipment. And then I don't know. We, we could do requests on games, maybe. Mm -hmm. I don't think we're at a point that anyone would do that, but if you want to set it up, no, 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 no. I'll, uh, I'll be right back. Sheila looks a lot different in the Reignited trilogy. Hunter looks a lot different. I just saw him for the first time. Oh, what does Hunter uh, uh, hold up. look like? Let me let me pull him up. Please do. So this level's giving me a lot of trouble for some reason. So you think this level would be a great opportunity for like a, a, a weird, maybe maybe wacky, even like pirate esque soundtrack? No. Nope. Just normal Spyro Amanda Bynes. Like, they, they got... He went all in for the, uh... For the Aztec is, Snow one. Nope. By the way, I apologize. This level appears to be giving me a significant trouble. Uh, uh, <laughs> he, he looks like he aged 20 years! <laughs> he does. He looks so old. There's a little better one on the bottom. <laughs> I hope that's not a Laura. <laughs> Why? Because she looks... If that's so, that she looks like a, a Banjo... I hope not, because she looks like a Banjo-Kazooie character. <laughs> no, 
Uh, that, that looks like, uh... Maybe it's Sheila. That looks like Sheila. Is she... <laughs> I think that's Sheila. I hope so. Oh, I'm feeling sick. Oh, yeah, I, I keep missing my shit. Well, I better go scavenge for food. They got the weird, uh, gemstone instrument. Please! I need to feast! Where is the food? At least they didn't use the Skylander Spyro design. They were smart enough not to do that. Yeah, you know what? No, we're not doing that. Hmm? Audio's fucking up. How is How's it? How's the audio fucking up? Is it cutting in and out, Darian? And is anyone else hearing that? It's still recording, so can, can you be more specific? Hearing crackles. Crackles. Is that just like what we're hearing? Like, is it coming from us or the game audio? Let me see if I can pull up the stream. Okay, go ahead. It's cutting in and out. Oh, God damn it. What? But this is a brand new mic! So is it... Maybe it's not the mic? Maybe it's something to do with the computer? Hold on. God. I fucking hate Rebel technology. Okay, yeah. Alright. <laughs> You don't mean cutting out a seconds for a time. This is a problem that we were having with the snowball. Was the it's? I would say it's different from crackles though. But I know what you're talking about. It was very bad during Tony Hawk. I just uh, oh right. I need to refocus. Yeah. Let me know if it's still going on. I just uh, fiddled with the mic a little bit. Gonna have to start streaming from your computer. <laughs> I mean, I, I'm not against that. It, it, we, uh, having my technology uh, right now. Isn't my computer slight, uh, slightly uh, better, like, stat wise? Well, yours is a couple years late, more recent than mine. Yeah. We have that one that we're gonna be getting from Sandy to the top. I yeah. just need to set that up. Yeah, thank you, Sandy. The Still going on. Uh, I guess, I guess we're done then, now. Well, stop moving. Hold on. I, d I, d I don't know what we can do. With Switch this back point. to the snowball? You want to get the snowball out? <laughs> I, I, I mean, it was happening with that. If it's happening to this, then it's, that means it's not the microphone, right? Uh, so your USB port? You switch USB ports? Okay, you know what? I, I can try that. I'm going to... Hold on a sec. Stick around. I'm going to stop streaming, and we'll be right back. Be a minute. Hmm. Okay. Okay, we're back. I'm sorry about that. Let me know if it's still going on. Okay. I will, uh. Do you want me to. Do you want me to take over while you're doing that? No, I'm good. Look at it. Oh. Someone said it wasn't that bad. It, it was just... I'd like for it to not happen at all. It was unwatchably bad for the Tony Hawk stream. Oh, you're friendly. Okay. Anti-air! So it's something I need to figure out about what's going on. Is it still, uh... 
Is it still happening? Can you guys still hear it? Holy shit, this crab. He's a dodgy crab. He doesn't want to get cannonballed. Got him! Oh, wait, hold on. I'm... Oh, mighty crab. Thank you. Here, look. Nice of these pirates to mark their, uh... Mark their, uh... Boats with their weak spots. Maybe it's like they were going to repair it and they marked an X where it's like, Arr, this needs to be fixed. Yeah. First. And they just kind of, you know, did it. I don't even need the cannon for these clowns. No. Well, because they're not real ghosts. Alright. Like, hey, Scoob, I think our new friend's pretty com competent. <laughs> they I think he might be able to take out these go pirate ghosts. Me treasure, Me huh? treasure. Craig. What do you think it tastes like, Shaggy? Craig Golightly, aka Vincent Dawn, aka the Cinema Snob. Alright. Yeah, we're gonna have to. I told Sandy the next time we can uh, meet up, I'll take that computer off his hands. We just gotta figure out when that is. And I guess that'll have to be our uh, designated streaming computer. Yeah. Well. Oh, for fuck's sake! Now you can swim in the toxic goo. Or whatever. Pirate goo. When you know we're turning, I gotta go back. Oh gosh. There's an egg down here, isn't there? Probably somewhere. I mean, that's just the water that's throughout the whole level. All you just did was go outside the ship again. Yeah. Alright. Atlas. That's a shame. I had thought that was the uh, snowball that was doing that. Hey. The snowball was innocent. Oh all no, the along. snowball was still crapping out. Apropos of nothing, so it was doing that. Swim through. Oh, it's acid. Oh, okay. What? What? Why is there just a lake of acid here? And it's happening again. How long have we been going? I don't know. I just restarted it. Um, uh, like an hour. It's only been that long. Well. I mean, we can, we can, like, store the save. Yeah. And just transfer all the files over on my computer for next time. It's good we're figuring this out, out we're finding this out now, then, like, with us, then, like, before us doing Majora, a game which would be very complicated to try to, like, stop in the middle of. Yeah. Well... I don't know, if it's still happening and we can't fix it, I guess that we're just gonna have to call it for today, yeah, right? fuck it. I don't want to have two hours of video footage that's just unwatchable. Yeah, don't, two hours of rebel technology. I'm, I'm sad that, that uh, we kind of lost the Tony Hawk stream to that. Yeah, that was, a, that was one of our better streams, too. <sighs> but I guess, I guess this is something we're gonna have to figure out. <laughs> we'll figure this to... out, we'll... Uh... Uh, not, we're not gonna be able today because we're on a limited, uh, limited time frame. Yeah, unfortunately, so, so. I'm sorry to do this to you guys, we appreciate your coming to watch, but sorry. we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to call it till we figure this out. Oh, man. Yeah, it's, so. Sorry, guys. We will come, we'll come back in the next couple days, hopefully, we'll be able to figure out something. We will figure this out, and we will be back. We will, uh, we'll either... Be streaming on Jack's computer. Yeah. Or else I'll figure out something with Sandy. Maybe I'll have to go to him. We'll see. We'll see. Thank you guys for tuning in for however long this was, though. We'll see you next time. See you next time.